Hi everybody, welcome back to another Food Review on the One channel. My name is Nick Manzoni, thank you for joining me today. Well folks, this is the last review of the day. I've done five videos today, and I hope you enjoyed review day. I've gotten very, very lucky on the end of what I reviewed today. Uh, everything from the Five Guys Shake, to the Lemon Croissant Donut, to the, the Triple Double Crunch Wrap, to now, the last item of the day, and I'm so excited for this, I finally found it. I went back to Wendy's and got myself the bacon mozzarella burger. And we're going to try it right now. We're going to open it up and see what it tastes like. And hopefully it's not tainted. But the last time I went to Wendy's, I was very, very impressed with the, uh, with the sandwich. I think I reviewed the... I don't know what I reviewed. I think it was the bacon fondue fries. But we're going to see how this is. Uh, okay. Uh, I got the double patty. I don't know why I got the double patty, but here is the burger. It's very hefty. It's very hearty. Uh, the bun seems to be a little bit stale, but uh, and there seems to be lettuce on it, but that's okay. We're not going to lose points for that. It's all in flavor, right? It's not in the presentation. So, I'm not even going to waste your time, folks. Let's get into the bacon mozzarella burger and see how it tastes. Interesting. One more bit. I want you to take it like this. Look at you. Focus on the presentation. I gotta say, I don't think the presentation is quite up there. Let's take a bite of this side. Look at this bacon, folks. Is this good bacon? Well, I'm gonna try it by itself and see how it is. Okay, bacon's pretty good. Can't complain on that side. Uh, let's take a just a piece of off. Now, I'm going to take a piece of the bread by itself. Mm. 
This is what we're going to do with this. <sighs> okay. Here's the deal. The Everything tasted fine. I'm not gonna complain about that. But the but the burger, uh, it was just off. It tasted weird. I don't know if it was the mozzarella or the fact that uh, I don't know. Maybe it was the double patty. But something just tasted off about that burger. Uh, the the aioli sauce is okay. It wasn't too anything spectacular. The bun, uh, I don't know if the bun was fresh or not, but uh, th that bun looked awful. <laughs> um, I don't know. Something was really off about that burger. Hmm. Maybe it was that, maybe, okay, I think I know what it was. Oh, there's a bad taste in your mouth. I think it was the fact that the mozzarella was on there. I think the the uh, mozzarella didn't didn't help the burger at all. It was very very still. It didn't taste like regular mozzarella. And I'm Italian, so I know what mozzarella tastes like. I know how to make mozzarella. I know what real mozzarella tastes like, and that was not real mozzarella. Uh, so I'm uh, I'm kind of disappointed. I'm very shocked because this is the first one these item where. I kind of am on the fence about this. Normally when these items are good, but for this particular item, for the bacon, bacon mozzarella burger, and I'm going to rate it right now on a scale of 1 to 10, I'll be giving the new Wendy's bacon mozzarella burger a rating of 5 out of 10, folks. It's, no, well, it's okay. It's blah. It's not, it's not good. It's not spectacular. It's just meh. It's, got no flavor to it, the beef was dry, um, the mozzarella threw the whole thing off, the, that wasn't, that wasn't mozzarella cheese that I'm used to, and I think it was the fact that the bun was kind of stale, and it was just, uh, I don't know, I'm, I'm very disappointed, I'm, I'm very surprised that Wendy's for doing this, um, and I, I, I really can't say anything more about that burger, because that was just meh, w what can you do, I mean, at, I know at Wendy's everything can't be winners and this was definitely a ground ball out or a fly ball out. Good execution, good thought process, but yeah, no. It was just eh, I don't know. And you could tell you could tell right from the beginning I didn't like it and I'm sorry, I'm sorry folks, but that's the first product from Wendy's I did not like. So, it gets a 5 or 10, maybe, maybe even a 304, if, uh, maybe a 5 is generous. I'm going to give it probably a 304, because uh, I think a 5 is too generous in this case. But, uh, let me know in the comments below if you like the bacon mozzarella burger, and if you had it different, uh, let me, let me know in the comments below. Uh, but that's my experience. I, yeah, it was just okay. It was meh. It wasn't. It wasn't too it, too spectacular. It wasn't too anything to write home about. Well, folks, that would do it for my, for the final review of the day. I want to thank you for joining me all day long today. Thank you for putting up three for our five videos. All these videos will be released this week, and on Wednesday. I will go. I will be going live from Disney Springs, so you're gonna see me at Disney Springs. You might even see me at Old Key West. Who knows? I have a I have a whole day planned on Wednesday. We'll see what happens. I can't guarantee anything, but in, until then, look for me then, and uh, we'll go from there. But until then, folks, you guys are the best fans in the world, and I want you to please like, please share, please subscribe to all my videos. I love you guys. You guys are the best. Quick shout out to uh, to Morgan. Uh, my co-worker at Disney, who's an, who's an entertainment, she's a cosplayer, uh, she's awesome, 
If you haven't gotten to look at her Facebook page, I have a link in the description below to our Facebook page. She does awesome work, and she's the probably one of the best best friends I've ever had in the world. So look out for our link. Go check out the link on Facebook. I will have it in the description below. But until then, folks, again, please like, please share, please subscribe. And from the food lab, folks, I want to say have an awesome weekend, and I want to say have a great night. And I will see you tomorrow morning with a brand new review from the food lab. This is Nick Manning signing off. I hope to see you back here tomorrow morning, folks. Take care.